an empty boat, a carnival, and goldfish. A Patch and Benny adventure? One sunny morning in the enchanted forest, Benny and Patch found themselves playing along the river. As they giggled and chased each other, their laughter echoed. They skipped rocks and splashed water playfully. Benny and Patch, the two adventurous young friends, were enjoying a sunny day by the river. Suddenly, their eyes caught sight of something peculiar, an empty boat slowly drifting towards the riverbank. Curiosity peaked, they decided to investigate. Without a second thought, they waded into the cool water and reached the floating boat. It swayed gently as they climbed aboard, wondering who might have left it there and where its owner could be. The boat was eerily quiet, devoid of any signs of life, but it intrigued the duo even more. As they searched the boat, they discovered faded fishing gear, a tattered map, and a few scattered books. The mystery deepened, and their imagination ran wild with possibilities of the boat's past adventures. Benny and Patch exchanged excited glances, making up stories about the boat's journey across distant seas and uncharted territories. As they pondered the boat's enigma, something caught their attention up ahead, colorful lights and the distant sound of merry music. They squinted their eyes and peered through the trees, and there it was, a vibrant carnival in full swing. Excitement surged through them like a tidal wave. Both Benny and Patch had never seen a carnival before, the whole scene was like a dream come true. They quickly abandoned the mysterious boat and scampered towards the carnival grounds. The sight of vibrant rides, candy stalls, and joyous people filled them with wonder and awe. They clutched each other's hands tightly, their hearts pounding with exhilaration as they explored every corner of the carnival. They rode the Ferris wheel, feeling on top of the world as they overlooked the breathtaking view from above. They devoured cotton candy, their laughter rising with every sugary bite. The day turned into a magical whirlwind of thrilling rides and delightful games. Benny and Pat's faces beamed with sheer happiness, and they couldn't believe their luck stumbling upon such a wondrous place. As they continued to explore, they stumbled upon a captivating booth adorned with a huge colorful fish swimming around inside a tank of water. A friendly sign read, Discover the marvels of goldfish and their watery world. Benny, let's check this out. It's just what we were looking for. Patch suggested, his eyes glimmering with anticipation. Benny agreed with a nod, and they approached the booth. A wise, old sea captain named Captain Tidal welcomed them warmly. Welcome young adventurers. Are you ready to learn about the mesmerizing world of goldfish? Captain Tidal asked with a warm smile. Benny and Patch nodded enthusiastically. Absolutely. We love learning new things. Benny replied, his ears packed up. Captain Tidal gestured to a magnificent display of goldfish in a large, crystal clear tank. These are goldfish, and they have some incredible secrets to share. Come, let's dive into the underwater wonders together. As Captain Tidal began to share fascinating facts about goldfish, Benny and Patch were captivated. They listened intently as he explained the significance of the fish's scales, how they breathed underwater, and what they ate to stay healthy. Eager to explore more, Benny asked, Captain Tidal, could you tell us where we might find goldfish? The wise Captain Tidal smiled, Ah, goldfish originated in East Asia, and they are known to inhabit calm and slow-moving waters like ponds and lakes. Their beauty and graceful nature have made them popular pets worldwide. Excitement bubbled within Benny and Patch as they soaked in the wealth of information. They were determined to learn more, and their hearts were set on seeing goldfish up close in a real aquatic setting. Captain Tidal, is there a place nearby where we can see goldfish in their natural environment? Patch asked eagerly. Indeed, there's a shimmering pond just beyond the fair where goldfish reside. It's a tranquil spot perfect for observing these majestic creatures. Captain Tidal replied with a knowing smile. Benny and Patch thanked the wise sea captain for his guidance as the three set off to the shimmering pond where the goldfish danced gracefully in the water. As they approached the pond, Benny and Patch noticed the golden fish's scales glistening like tiny jewels. Curiosity took over, and they began their investigation. Patch, look at those scales. They're so shiny and pretty, Benny said with awe. Captain Tidal said, Yes, Benny. Those scales are what make goldfish so unique. 
Each scale helps protect the fish and keep them safe from predators. Benny and Patch, let me tell you about these marvelous fish, he began. Goldfish scales act as armor, shielding them from harm in their watery habitat. They are also responsible for the fish's beautiful colors, which can vary from gold to orange, white, and even black. Amazed by this revelation, Benny and Patch couldn't wait to learn more. Captain Tidal continued. Fish scales are made of a substance called keratin, just like our hair and nails. This material gives the scales strength and flexibility. Intrigued by the fish's ability to breathe underwater, Benny asked, How do goldfish breathe without gills like us? Captain Tidal smiled, Excellent question. Goldfish have gills hidden beneath their gill covers, which allow them to extract oxygen from the water. As water passes over their gills, they absorb the oxygen they need to survive. Patch tilted his head. So, they can stay underwater for a long time. Yes indeed, confirmed Captain Tidal. The gills enable them to breathe continuously as long as they're in water. However, it's important to ensure the water is clean and well oxygenated for the fish to stay healthy. Curiosity peaked once more, Benny asked. What do goldfish eat? Captain Tidal shared his wisdom. Goldfish are omnivores, which means they eat both plants and small aquatic creatures. They enjoy a diet of fish pellets, flakes, and fresh veggies like peas and lettuce. Providing a balanced diet is essential for their well-being. As they walked around the pond, Benny and Patch observed the goldfish swimming gracefully in their aquatic paradise. Captain Tidal continued to share more fascinating facts about fish, including how they communicate with each other using body language and their keen senses. With each new piece of knowledge, Benny and Patch's appreciation for the underwater world grew. They realized that every creature, no matter how small, played a vital role in maintaining the delicate balance of nature. Side by side, with hearts full of joy and heads brimming with fantastic tales of their adventures, they journeyed back home. Benny and Patch knew they would forever treasure this extraordinary day. A day when they discovered an empty boat and, with it, a gateway to a marvelous world where they discovered the joys of a carnival, and learned about goldfish. <laughs>